old school auditoriums and stuff, you know. That's right. And the guys are able to make actually a pretty good living from the sport now if they're right at the top. The man who started it all, of course, Arnold, part of the action too. First uh, spectacular worldwide champion, so to speak, Arnold was. Now Greg Kovacs, 335 pounds. Well, he's definitely a big man, and he has a, you know, he has a reputation of being the strongest uh, bodybuilder around. Whether that's true or not, I don't know, but he's a, he's a strong guy, he's a big guy. From Toronto, Canada, Greg Kovacs, his first big pro show. Yeah, he did a Night of Champions a couple of, a few years back, but he, he dropped out after a pre-judge and he wasn't in good shape, he didn't feel well. He's definitely in better shape tonight, but uh, he really he doesn't have the structure to compete with the top guys in the show. His, his legs are a little weak compared to his, to his upper body. He doesn't have the lines of, of people like Cormier and uh, Dexter Jackson. Known as one of the strongest bodybuilders in the world. He, d he does that of that reputation, yeah. And I'm, uh, I'm sure he's a strong guy. I've seen him in the gym a few times. He's, he's moving some weights around. But that, uh, that doesn't matter too much when you're on stage, how much you weigh, how, how much you can lift. It's all about how, um, how you look on stage. It's a visual sport. That's Greg Sensen. He's not doing too well tonight. He seemed to put that routine pretty short there. Exactly. That was my thought. But he uh, has left the stage here a bit early. We have one more competitor in the individual posing routine.